Eagle says, can you explain to me like I'm five, how are you playing TL in the US? Is it super hard or should I just wait a month? It is not super hard. All you're gonna have to do is pretty much two things. You gotta make a brand new email account, all right? It could be whatever you want to be. Just make a brand new email account and that way it's not connected to your NA account. So you just make a brand new Gmail account, doesn't matter what it is, as long as you remember the password and link it to your existing email, right? And then the second thing you need to do is you need to get a VPN. I use exit lag, it costs $8 a month. So a VPN, and then you're gonna connect two things into the VPN. You're gonna have this VPN, making sure that it's connected to Throne and Liberty. You'll literally type in Throne, and it'll say Throne and Liberty Korea, and then you'll type in NC Purple, and then those are the two that you're going to basically select your VPNs to. And then you're gonna say Korea, and you're gonna select one out of the six different Koreans IPs. Once you've done that, you can then go make an account on NCSoft's main website and use that e new email that you made. And then you're gonna select your location and you're gonna say your location is in Russia. That's fucking weird, I don't get it. But somehow anybody who makes a Russian account with their existing Gmail account that they just made, it doesn't have to be Gmail Russian, it's just a normal Gmail account. You go make an account on NC's website and you say that you are from Russia, it lets you just make an account there and they don't question it. They have no way of saying anything to you. You VPN into the game and you can play from the US. And that's it. Uh, that's how you get a chance to play. And if you want to understand, you know, how to read or understand Korean, you don't need to do that because you just go over here, settings, Right when you click the settings button, this is very important because this is what's going to screw you. You're going to see all Korean. You're going to have a heart attack. Click on settings. I'll just do it for you just to show you what it looked like originally for me. So this is what it looks like. Sorry, it's going to have all Korean text, right? You're going to click on this Korean like little logo here. Make sure you save this or clip this because if you tell me what do I do, I can show you again on stream if you find me live on stream. You go to the last tab. Obviously, nothing's in English. The very last tab of the first opening. The very first tab at the very top and then select English, everything goes English. And that's how you do it. Hope that was helpful.